What's up guys and welcome back to another tutorial. I just wanted to do a little quick update about the uh, free Xfinity Wi-Fi on any Android. Um, there's been a lot of questions. I've been flooded with um, questions like, this is not work, how do I do this? This doesn't want to change, like I'm getting some error or something. And this is like an updated version with the new update where they have like this on-demand pass. I mean, it's still like kind of the same process, so it's pretty easy. And um, you of course will need to have your device rooted. So I have my device rooted, it's a Galaxy S7 from Sprint. I'll drop some links down below where you guys could root your device. Be sure to check it out, root your phone, and then once you have rooted your phone, come back to this video and we could begin this process. So first of all, what you need to do is go to Play Store. And just to confirm you, to you guys that I am rooted, I am gonna do really quick root check for you guys. Go agree and just go verify root. And if this pop up, pops up, then there you go, you have root on your device. Of course, you guys, you guys can see I am rooted. So go to the Play Store and type in the same app that we used in the other video, um, Mac Changer. Changer. There you go. Click on it and install it. So once you've installed Wi-Fi Mac Changer and uh, as you guys could see I am not connected to any network and I will also turn off data for you guys right here turn off data and as you guys could see there is no data or I'm not connected to any other Wi-Fi as usual you'd probably go to Wi-Fi and then Xfinity and once it connects um, it's gonna say sign in to the network and if you scroll down or on some devices, it's just going to pop up straight into your browser. But for mine, some reason didn't. I'm just going to scroll down into the notification and I will sign in to Wi-Fi network. And it's going to bring me up to um, this website, Xfinity. So same process as the last video. So just go to, I don't have an Xfinity Wi-Fi, Xfinity account, I mean, sorry, and get a on what on Wi-Fi demand pass and let just go through the setup it's pretty simple scroll down hit continue and here it doesn't really matter you can just enter random stuff hit continue and I think this is where some people were like whoa this is not in the tutorial from the last video and uh, they were like freaking out so just still random stuff well accept the password you want have something I don't know just make up a password doesn't have to be like that you have to memorize just make a password and there's a question just put random stuff doesn't really matter hit continue and it should just let it load and it's gonna say this scroll down a bit and hit activate pass and boom you're connected and once your one hour pass has expired what you want to do is go to Wi-Fi Mac changer and it's gonna ask you for root permissions so what you give it root permissions for it to change your Mac address and just hit generate random Mac you could hit it a few times doesn't really matter and then you could, you could either do hard change or simple change doesn't really matter so just hit random, I mean hit hard change or simple change and let it change your Mac address. And if it says right here, as you guys could see, it says Mac not change, please check the Mac address and generate Mac address again and try simple change. Maybe, yeah, see, as you guys could see, sometimes a simple change is more successful to change um, instead of the hard change, but do either or whatever works for you guys and then as you guys could see again it shows the Wi-Fi signing signing into Xfinity so I guess every hour you're just gonna keep on doing this going I don't have an Xfinity account get a Wi-Fi on-demand pass 
you're just gonna keep doing this every hour of Xfinity Wi-Fi that you need and uh, just go blah 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 at blah 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 dot com five digit zip code anything just blah 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 hit continue and just here again go blah 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 and the password just go just anything that you can memorize and as you guys can see it just says just type in some more blah blah blahs and the question random blah 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 continue and it's gonna bring you up to this page again just scroll down and then activate pass and that should activate the internet boom see it works connected to xfinity wi-fi now if you just go on youtube you could like search up anything see everything works perfectly fine loaded and as you guys could see i am connected to xfinity wi-fi so uh, guys this is pretty much it and uh thank you guys for watching and if you guys want to see how i turned this galaxy s7 into like an s8 theme like even the restart menus um, be sure to tell me down below if you guys want to see that and uh, otherwise thank you guys for watching hit that like button comment below what you want to see me do any video ideas just drop it down below and uh, be sure to hit that subscribe button and uh, I'll see you guys next time peace